we are facing one of the biggest challenges in history. Our earth is drying up. Don't let our future dry up before our eyes. Join me in starting a green revolution. If we can warm up the earth, we can also cool it down. By greening up, it's that simple. The solution to climate change is vegetation. It's the air conditioning of our planet and it eats carbon for breakfast. Through simple nature-based solutions, we can capture 20 billion tons of CO2 annually. This means that we can reverse climate change within 30 years. So let's green up to cool down. Here's how. With more tree cover on degraded farmlands and rangelands, we can triple the rate of biomass carbon. By increasing soil carbon and conserving the land, farmers can grow the size and reliability of crops and store huge amounts of carbon at the same time. By planting shrubs in food crops, we can capture carbon, fertilize crops and provide wood fuel without reducing arable land. That's why millions of farmers in Africa have already adopted this. By 2050, the carbon stored from nature-based solutions can be used to bring energy to hundreds of millions of people. We have 4 billion hectares of forest land in the world, of which 1.7 billion hectares are degraded and treeless. Through empowering communities, we can turn 575 million hectares into healthy forests again. And last but not least, by suppressing fires and by regenerating pastures, we can bring back a healthy grass tree balance, enhance food production for livestock and improve animal welfare. So, dear members of the United Nations, the solution to climate change has already been found. These methods work. The only thing we need to do is to embrace them and join forces. Together, we can speed up and scale up. Together, we can reverse climate change. So, let's green up to cool down.